Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah if you are new here and today we are playing another episode of Dream Home Decorator Pack <laughs> I get so confused with this pack name, I'm sorry. But we're just gonna play a little bit more with Lawrence and see if we have better luck uh, in this episode. I read through all your guys' comments and a lot of you were saying that it was Wonderful Whims that was giving me issues. So I decided to take that mod out for this episode and see how smoothly things run for us without it. I know that the pack itself has bugs, um, but my bugs were like exceptionally bad. So, um, and I know that it's it's from my mods. So we're just gonna take it slow, just play it the little, a little bit more of the pack. I'm gonna play as many episodes as I want to just like really get the feel for the pack and experience it some more. And a lot of you guys want Lawrence to have redemption from the last episode because that was really bad. <laughs> I'm not taking it too seriously. I'm kind of just relaxing, playing the pack with you guys, having some fun, and I hope that you're enjoying it. I don't have a Celsius today. I actually have boba. I have a rose milk tea, a non-dairy one. So cheers. Cheers to you. Cheers to this video. I'm excited to play more Dream Home Decorated with you guys. Let's get into it. All right, you guys. So I went ahead and got us a new gig. So we are doing the client baron and this is a good sign i have these circles here now which i didn't have before and also it didn't tell me the client's name either so is he really going outside to mop a puddle is this man serious sir oh god he, he ran back in i was gonna say he he's is he neat yeah he's a neat sim but that's i think i feel like that's pushing it <laughs> going outside in the thunderstorm to mop the rain. <laughs> anyway, as I was saying, we do have these circles, so that's a good sign. Our reputation is just okay. I'm honestly a little bit curious to see what happens when your reputation is like in the red. Like, do you get fired? I mean, I I'm sure you could because it's actually like a career. It's not like a freelance thing. So I don't know. And for some reason, our performance is still good, which I'm a little shocked about, but you know what? I'll take it. <laughs> So his mood's pretty good. He's not gonna sleep for that long. When they're not sleepy, they kind of just like take a really quick nap. Uh, I'm just kind of waiting until uh, 9 a.m. I watched a ton. Oh no, he didn't have a good July 4th. I'm gonna just get rid of that mood lit. <laughs> and the rats, I swear, this apartment. <laughs> He hates it. <laughs> um, so yeah, in the comments, you guys said that um, <clears throat> with the career, you can talk to any sim and get their their um, style tastes, which is still really confusing because if there's like a bunch of sims and you ask them what they like and what they don't like, like one sim could not like green and one sim could like green. It's still just a little bit confusing to me, um, like regarding that kind of thing. And then also with what room you choose, I guess when you just do like a room renovation, just a basic room renovation like this one right here, you can choose what room you want to do. So that's exactly what we did last time because I, I honestly had no other choice. <laughs> so yeah, that is all cleared up for me then. Oh my God, he's really going outside to mop another puddle. I can't with him right now. I can't. He needs to, to relax, okay? Just please relax. Who does that? I do want to see what happens when you get like to the top of your career though, and like how, how different things are. So after we do this one, I think we should like cheat and promote him a little bit and see what's good with like the, the higher level gigs. <clears throat> Is he angry about the rats? You don't have to be angry about the rats. They're just free pets. Think of it that way, sir. All right, let's have a snacky before we go. Let's just have some edamame, delicious. I had some edamame last night. Chef's kiss, I made my own sauce with like ginger and garlic and soy sauce and sesame oil. It was so good. Okay, he ate his edamame. We have an hour before we have to go to school. What? No, work, sorry. Okay, it looks like we got the pop-up, which is a good sign. And apparently you're supposed to get a pop-up when your gig starts, That's that'll take you to the lot. So you don't have to know where everyone lives necessarily, it'll just take you there. So let's see if it does that for us. Okay, here we go. Time to design, it's time for Lawrence to head to the client's lot. Okay, yeah, let's go. Okay, so yeah, it does take you. I thought for some reason that we had to travel there ourselves. I don't know why I thought that. <laughs> Probably because the first gig we did, I never got a pop-up. So I was like, wait, are we just supposed to go on our own? Or not, like, are we just supposed to figure out where these people live? 
I am so confused. All right, come on, sir. Let's get this bread. Let's get that uh, reputation up a little bit. Hi, I'm Lawrence. It's so, so, so nice to meet you. Let's just give her a friendly introduction. Um, Lawrence is doing, hold on, what? Lawrence is doing something unprofessional? Continue behaving up poorly on that. What are you talking about? What did we do that was unprofessional? I'm annoyed. Whatever. Whatever, Sims. What's up, girl? Bridget. Hey, how's it going? Why are you tense? Um, okay. Discuss designs. I am hoping that this works. And I'm gonna try and do the before and after pics, like, properly so we can see the fancy slideshow. Okay, cool. Uh, we got one. Dislikes guitar. Okay, that doesn't really help us. Um, cha-cha-cha. Ask about favorite designs and discuss designs and encourage to come out. <laughs> what? You just met this lady. Ask about taste and decor. Ooh, the flea market's in town too. He seems like someone that would go to the flea market and look for like vintage pieces for his apartment. I kind of want to do that, but I'm getting ahead of myself once again. I'm glad there's only one sim for this gig. It makes it a lot less confusing. Likes modern decor? Oh my gosh, a woman after my own heart, I swear. How come it's not popping up here though? Complain about restrictive budget? No! You're trying to get her to like you. Oh, here we go, here we go. Dislikes mid-century? Boo! I love mid-century. Um... Oh, we got a sentiment. You know what? It's been wonderful to spend time with you. Okay, I'm glad she likes us. We just need to get that one last. Hopefully she tells us something that she likes and not just a bunch of things that she doesn't like because that makes it very difficult. At least the conversation's pleasant. She's still feeling tense though. She's probably feeling tense about, oh God, another dislike. Um, dislikes gardening. It said that she likes modern, so. I guess we'll give this a shot. Uh, I say we redo the kitchen. All right, Miss Lady, I'm gonna need you to GTFO, you know what I'm saying? Yes, okay, go. Hopefully she leaves, because th that was another glitch that I had. Oh, she left! Thank goodness. Okay, well, let's use the bathroom. Let's just make ourselves at home. Uh, how else? What else do we need? A little bit hungry, too. Let's have... Hmm, what do we want? No, not make a sack lunch. Have a quick meal. Let's have some cheese crackers right i mean you can't work on an empty stomach you know it just doesn't work like that and i love how you can just make yourself at home when you send them away it's just like okay cool i could throw a party if i wanted to all right let's go ahead and take some before photos of this very sad kitchen oh who's that shoot there is another sim here yikes all right let's get that angle cha chow this angle ba bow and this angle boom okay all right let's do this let's make her a very modern kitchen with no guitars and no gardening anywhere in sight all right okay let's put on the modern filter <gasps> lovely just lovely oh man hmm should we use the eco floor love the eco floor or should we do wood flooring? Let's do this floor and then let's find a modern. I like how some CC is showing up in modern as well, but I'm kind of scared. I don't know if I want to risk it. And I hate, hate, hate how you can't shift, shift and apply the wallpaper on, um, on the entire room for some reason. Like that's like another glitch apparently. You can alt, but you can't shift, which is a very strange glitch to have. Okay, let's get some modern lights up in here. Okay, let's just do this one. All right, back to the kitchen area. We have a couple of modern cabinets. Oh, we can use the, the, the cabinets from the new pack. Those are considered modern. I would say that this kitchen is looking pretty modern so far, <laughs> so I'm satisfied. Um, I always forget to put like upper cabinets, but um, I did not forget this time. Are you proud? <laughs> so funny. So many of you guys came for me in the comments because I forgot the bathroom <laughs> in our apartment build. Look, I'm sorry, all right? I always, 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 always seem to forget the bathroom. It just happens. Ooh, look at that. Same swatch, but like completely different 
colors. Ugh, don't like. No like, no like, no like. Oh, I am way over budget. Holy cannoli, I, whoops. Okay, hold on, let me find a cheap refrigerator then. I didn't forget a sink. Are you proud of me? I swear, they better like this. They better. Who wouldn't like this kitchen? Uggles. Nah, you uggles, ma'am. Okay, we got a nice little like hanging towel here and maybe we can add some hand soap. All right, I think it looks good. It's not like super fancy or anything, but like it's better than it was, you know? And we are under budget, which is fantastic. No new floor tiles allowed. Uh-oh. Do y'all remember what it was before? Was it this floor? It still doesn't look bad. Okay, I didn't even realize there was restrictions. Okay, yeah, I need to pay more attention. What's this? Trades? Okay. All right. Dislikes gardening, dislikes mid-century, and dislikes guitar. Okay. All right, let's uh, go ahead and call the clients back. Boom. I don't understand why it's still doing this. <laughs> I don't get it. Who are you? Oh, get rid of the cheese cracker evidence. What's wrong? Oops, from encouraging Sim to come out. What? Who did you do that to? Yes, I'll personally do it. Sure, why not? All right, reveal. Dun 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 Moment of truth. Hey, it looks pretty good. I'm so scared right now. What? I didn't even get to, I didn't even, you've done enough, please see yourself out. Now, how do we undo some of this? Oh, come on, it's not that bad. What do you want? Will I ever, will I ever do good? Will I ever make any money? Or are we just like destined to be a terrible interior designer? Oh my goodness. All right, well, let's go ahead. Oh no. Oh no, we might as well just figure out what happens when you get to the red, am I right? All right, let's do this one. I don't know, maybe we should do something fun <laughs> while we wait for our next gig. So I'm just gonna get him to get his energy up a little bit. And let's see, who do we know? Honey, what's wrong? Go to sleep. Oh, it's the freaking rats, isn't it? Let's, uh, should we invite Paolo or Hugo out? Welcome to the neighborhood. Welcome, wagon. Right now? Oh, who's this? We've got Mr. Greenbrows, Arav. We've got Marcus Flex. We got Baco and um, Brittany. I guess we can invite them in. I mean, we got rats, but okay, they're coming in. What do you guys think? Do you like my apartment? Do you like, oh shoot, she saw the rat. Oof. Oh God, they're all reacting really badly to the rat. Well, who is this? Let's do a funny introduction to him because he looks really cute. Greet new neighbor. Um, thanks for coming. Hi, yes, I have a rat problem. I apologize. I'm gonna, oh no, it gave us negative relationship. The rat. Oh, look at him, he's so colorful. I'm so sorry about the rats. Oh, Lawrence has learned the following trait about Arav. Dot. Love to see it. Love to see it. I love that trait so much. So what do you do for a living? Uh, oh, he's a DJ. Okay, that's pretty cool. Hang on. Let me, um, I would like to go into cast. I want to give him a little makeover because, um, I can't help it. All right, you guys, I gave him a way better look than he had before. I gave him a little eyeliner too. I really like him. I think he's very, very cute. All right, let's get back into some gameplay. I'm glad we can make a friend. Thankful that Welcome Wagon rolled around. Ooh, shoot, I wanted to go to the flea market. Maybe he'll want to go with us. The festival has not started yet. Oh, Sunday. Wait, it's over. Dang it, we missed it. Ah, oh well. These rats, though. What are we supposed to do about this? <laughs> I suppose we can complain the landlord. Maybe wait and see if it gets better or worse. Oh my god. All right, they're leaving. That was not. Uh, that was not a successful hangout. Our place is looking dusty, and there's rats everywhere. Even though it's nicely decorated. Oh, there's a dust bunny. Hi, baby. Search for valuables, would ya? Oh shoot, now, oh my god, our electric box is sizzling. 
Yo, this apartment, I cannot. Anyway, let's get some sleep before our gig tomorrow. <laughs> This poor guy, his aspiration is to have a perfectly pristine home and it's just like not perfectly pristine, like not even a little bit. Excuse you, why are you in our apartment? Please, what the heck? Okay, I mean, I guess. Yeah, he peed himself. Get, oh my God, this is, uh... this is chaos. Why did I choose to live in an apartment? Apartment living is so difficult in this game okay his uh mood is not the best so i'm not really sure how well this is gonna go but let's go ahead and introduce ourselves a friendly introduction hello hi i'm lawrence i'm your interior designer um how's it going Daru. okay she likes french country decor oh there's a couple of people crap this is gonna be difficult Oh, and she likes white. Okay. And this client likes orange. He is literally dying from embarrassment right now. No! We're just gonna pretend like that never happened. Okay, okay. <laughs> so I'm just gonna move him into like not an apartment because he died from embarrassment because one, his place was infested with rats and the welcome wagon came and they were probably like, what the heck? And it didn't help that one of those Sims was famous. Number two, he peed himself. Number three, he is failing at his job. Honestly, I oh, I don't blame the guy. I do not blame the guy. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go ahead and place this build by a deligacy. It is a, star a dream home decorator starter. I seriously cannot believe this happened. Actually, I can. My let's plays are always so chaotic and all over the place and just, <sighs> I'm sorry, you guys probably get so frustrated with me sometimes <laughs> and I don't blame you. <laughs> Okay, well, this is really, really cute. I like this. So let's go ahead and find another gig. Let's try this again. We actually need to do join the career again because, yeah, this man's we're like starting starting fresh, which I feel like he he might need. Oh God, why is the welcome wagon coming at 3 a.m.? It's an apartment. Shoot. Okay, who is our client? Bordeaux. All right, this is a Bordeaux. Let's give her a friendly introduction. All right, so this client dislikes island decor, likes guitar, and likes mixology. Yes, let's send them away. Goodbye. Okay, so I'm gonna do this little room right here. <laughs> and uh, let's take some before photos. It doesn't even seem as though that they have kids. So uh, I'm gonna put two guitars. I'm gonna put a bar with some bar stools. Okay, don't forget the bar stools. Okay, there we go. Guitar and mixology, take after photos. Okay, they're actually covering their eyes this time and walking in the room. Okay, what do you think? It's giving me the slideshow now, which is great. God. Oh God. So. Well. Oh, she likes it. You guys, I think we actually might make some money today. Ooh. Ooh, she's done. Okay. What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? Please tell me you loved it. Please. I feel so accomplished right now. I just added a bar and some guitars and she liked it. He liked it too? <gasps> you guys! I feel so, so, so accomplished. Oh my gosh. Nice work. The client seemed to enjoy the newly renovated space. 
What we're gonna do next is I'm gonna promote him a couple of times. Certified interior designer. Let's search for a gig and see what we have now that we're pretty, uh, we're pretty good. Fabulous living room renovation. Studio photography studio edition. Interesting level renovation. Oh my level edition Add a level to this home <gasps> Whoa, okay. I'm debating if we should do Photography studio or fabulous living room renovation. Let's do the photo studio. I'm I'm like very interested in that All right, let's go to work. Let's do this photo studio I'm just curious to see like how different it's going to be now that we're like pretty leveled up versus being level one Ooh, ooh, we in Suwannee. Very good. Okay. Uh, hello. Let's just hit it hit everyone with a friendly intro Don't like purple yeah. Likes Queen Anne uh, decor, likes research and debate, likes photography. Okay. Oh, you guys, look. Floor tiles. I have to add floor tiles. Okay. And there is like a limit to how many floor tiles you can add. All right. I added a photo studio in here. Okay. And they like Queen Anne decor and research and debate. So let's see. Maybe we should put a podium in here. <laughs> okay. Um, Queen Anne decor. All right. Let me uh, just throw something that's Queen Anne in there. Ah, here we go. Boom. Okay, you guys, they're back. Let's go ahead and reveal what the monstrosity that we have built back here and see how they feel about it. Oh no. Please check out all this stuff that I just threw in this room. Oh, he wants a hug. That's so sweet. Bing ba bang. What do you think, lovers? What do you think? Oh, oh, did she like it? That that was a good sound that I heard, I think. Very good, very good. What do you think, ma'am? Oh no, she didn't like it. Uggles. Uggles? No, not the Uggles. <laughs> okay, but we made a good amount of money though. Okay, so what I am um, finding out from this career is that you do not need to make a pretty space at all you just need to pay attention to what they like and what they don't like and just load the room up with what they like that's it why is there always random people on our lot hi chance i guess you did a good job it's just not my taste technically all the boxes were checked fair hi how's it going it's very nice to meet you, sir. So yeah, you don't even have to be a good builder to do well in the career, apparently. Of course, for those of you guys that want to like build pretty spaces for this for your Sims, you totally can take that route. But for those of you that aren't like huge fans of building, it's still nice that you can do this career. <laughs> and not be a good builder you just have to pay attention to what they like and that's it like you guys saw that last room i just made that was a horror show they could barely even walk around in there but since they like photography and research and debate those things were in there and they were like heck yeah this is what i'm talking about this is a renovation <laughs> so this is what you get when you get to level 10 of the interior design career a gold laptop. Shing, shing. Sparkle, sparkle. <laughs> Commercial lot, huh? Bar renovation. Oh, that's so sick. Bathroom addition. $9,386. Holy crap. I'm kind of intrigued. I like how it's not a freelance career, but you can pick and choose when you want to work as well. Like you can make your own schedule like, oh shoot, I need some money. Let me go quickly do an interior design job really quick. Looks like we're in Evergreen Harbor at the caboose, right? Is this the caboose? Hello, I'm here on behalf of the caboose. Just ask me what you want to know. Yes, sir. 
This is a commercial gig and not a residential gig. Uh, okay, we got him, we got him. Likes Queen Anne, likes comedy, likes fitness, dislikes handiness. I'm very confused how we're supposed to make a bathroom based on that. I wonder if I, <laughs> if I should just make a bathroom and just throw some like, some microphones in there, a treadmill maybe. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm so interested. Okay, let me just turn on Queen Anne's really quick. Okay, I'm gonna put one of these microphones here in the corner. And then for fitness, let's put, let's put a treadmill. Okay, what else? Dislikes handiness, likes fitness, likes comedy, likes Queen Anne. Okay, I think we checked all of the boxes. Oh, it just needs some mirrors, hold on. I know this is hideous, trust me, I know. <laughs> This is the worst bathroom I've ever made in my life. <laughs> Help. All right, you guys, here we go. Here we go. I, <laughs> okay. He came into the stall. He's thinking about balloons. Check this out. Check this out. Check this out. You, you can go to the bathroom, then hit your fitness. You can go to the bathroom, hit your comedy. Over here, we have some Queen Anne's counters. What do you think, huh? What do you think? This is a lot to take in. I'm ready to talk about the changes. All right, let's see. Is he crying? Oh my God, we got our first hug, you guys. $990 for this bathroom. <laughs> Oh my God, before I was actually trying to make it look good, I was like taking 10 to 20 minutes for each room. I did this in freaking two minutes and wow, I got a tears and a hug. That is so funny. You can make so much money doing pretty much nothing. The clients seem to really like the new layout. The keen eye for detail seemed to really pay off. <laughs> Whatever you say, whatever you say. Oh, sheesh. Well, I'm glad we were able to redeem Mr. Lawrence here. Oh, He's been through a lot. He went through his lowest lows, died from it, came back to life and is absolutely killing the game now. I'm so proud of him. Oh, very nice. See, look at him. He's feeling himself, y'all. Absolutely. So let me just brush my shoulders <laughs> off, flex a little bit. Yeah, buddy, I'm back. Let's go. Well, that's gonna be it for today, you guys. I hope you enjoyed uh, Lawrence's redemption. I just wanted to give it another shot after reading all your comments and y'all telling me like what exactly it is that's breaking my game and how exactly to play this pack. But now that I feel like I have a better understanding of it, um, I feel like it's definitely doable, even though it does still have its little glitches and bugs. Um, this went a lot better than it did in the last episode. <laughs> I think it's cool that you don't have to be this like master builder to take place in this career, or not take place in the career, but to like have this career. So let's say that you, your sim wants to be an interior designer, but you're no good at building. As long as you know what the client wants and likes, that's really all that you need. It doesn't need to be very fancy decorated or anything like that, which I think is cool. So yeah, it can really like any kind of player can do this career. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you so much and I will see you in my next video. Bye.